Good morning, you guys. Oh, that was that was aggressive. I'm sorry. That was aggressive. Hello and good morning, you guys. <laughs> I don't know why I did that. I'm missing nails, by the way, so don't pick on me. I'm gonna fix it in a moment. But it is 7.50 right now, and in about an hour, I'm meeting up with my friend Katie, and we are gonna go for a little run. I'm so excited. Because usually I run on my own, and you know, I, I don't have people. So Running with someone is extra. I need to vlog it, truly. Because in the past, I used to run with my mom. So back when I lived in Poland, I used to run with my mom a few times a week. I was in my running era before it became trendy. Um, and I remember most of the times it would be so much fun because we would just talk through the whole run. And yeah, and it would just go like that. So I'm super excited for another sociable run because I haven't had one in a while. And so we're gonna get ready in a second. I'm just drinking my coffee real quick because there is no run without a coffee. I'm slowly thinking about doing a detox, not gonna lie, because it's becoming a problem. But, you know, I'm gonna think about it. We'll see, no rush. <laughs> Thankfully, it does not really make me want to go to the toilet that much because I know some people can't drink coffee before the run or just before going out of the house because it, it does wonders but for me i'm good so i'm just drinking my coffee i'm gonna get ready in a second and on another note we are on week four of my marathon training how crazy is that it's been a month i've been preparing for almost a month mind-blowing honestly it went by so fast but what's amazing about it is that i just realized that this week the fourth week it's kind of like a deload week and so i am decreasing my distances for this week and i'm doing like all of the runs, so three of the runs are about 5k, 5-6k. It's actually perfectly aligned with my cycle because I'm gonna be going on my period very soon. And soon I'm gonna be able to just take it a bit slower thanks to my plan. Um, yeah, so I'm just very happy that it aligned and I'm excited for this week because honestly I feel like my body needs it. Like for the last few days it's been feeling a bit tired and so I feel like this week just comes like a miracle, you know, because my body needs a little moment to recover itself properly. But you guys, I can't talk too much. I need to get ready, take Snowy for a walk because my girl is not coming with me. She's too small for that. And I'm gonna get going because we are gonna be running in a Chelsea and so I need to kind of commute a little bit. But it's okay, I'm excited because also something different, a new route. I need to, I need to travel more around London to run because it's gonna get boring soon. So yeah, guys, let's get ready. Let's get ready because I'm 8 a.m. Yeah, I have 30 minutes, let's go. It went by so fast, um, but the hair is crazy now, unfortunately. But yeah, it was so fun. You are so fast, Maya's so fast. I was like, conversational pace, conversational pace. <laughs> like that Just keep yourself. <laughs> oh. I'm a little tired. dressed in a little sweatsuit situation because I'm gonna be working from home today. I think I have a meeting in like 25 minutes and I'm not prepared for it so I need to prepare for it in a second but honestly the run was just so nice. We did like five and a half kilometers and then we went for a little brunch as you could see and I was gonna have therapy at 2 p.m but 
it got cancelled. <laughs> so I think I'm just gonna I'm just gonna stay at home and do my thing. But I'm so glad I finished my workout. But the thing is, I'm always so tired after running. Like so tired. I don't know what it is. I guess it's just a pretty straining exercise, but I'm never that tired after any workout. And after runs, I'm just like yeah. up until lunch. And after lunch, it's all good. So maybe it's about fuel, electrolytes. Katie recommended me IV, liquid IV. So I might try these and she said that they're really nice. So I'm gonna try them because the ones I'm taking, no. It's not it. break from work is required because I just got the most exciting package. Is the camera good? Let me just move this. We don't want to hurt my little plant. I got the most exciting package in the mail a second ago and I got, I don't know how to show you to not show my address, but I got a package from Bloom, Blue Bloom. Not sponsored or anything, but I ordered some glasses from them, some frames, because I'm looking for blue light glasses that I can also just use as a little bit of like an accessory. And I ordered five frames because they offer like a free trial thing. And let's try them on together. I'm so excited because a few weeks ago I ordered a first package from them and I tried some glasses on. And then I just remembered the names of the frames that I really liked and I ordered another one just to like make sure which one I really want. I am so excited. You don't, you, you don't even get it. I'm so excited. Okay. And also, they come in such a cool packaging. Take a look. Like, so nice. But okay, are you ready, you guys? I am excited. And you need to tell me in the comments before I make a final decision. I'm gonna make a final decision after posting this vlog. So you guys, let me know which one you like the most, okay? So these are the frames that I got. I don't know if you can really see them. Let's try them on. Let's start with this one because these ones, these ones are the ones I'm thinking about the most. What do we think? Yeah, I'm vibing with them, not gonna lie. Okay, so I have the transparent one once in one more frame, like a different, slightly different shape, a bit smaller. Like this. Yeah, I think I prefer the bigger ones, the previous ones. So these are like that. Huh. These are gonna be the, sh the same shape as the ones I just showed you. So I'm probably not gonna like them because they are a bit small, but let's take a look. Um, yeah, they are too small, too narrow for my face. My face is kind of wide. Yeah, okay, no. I have two more. And these are from the, the same shape, the same frame as the first ones. So I think I'm gonna like them. It's just about like choosing the design, the color. So now we're gonna try these. So pretty. So these are a bit, you know, more defined. I like them too, you guys. I like them. Okay, and the last ones. Are you ready? They are kind of, they are kind of similar, but a bit brighter. So they look like this. This is so exciting to me. I love them. Oh fuck! I literally don't know which one to get. Like I all, I love all three of them. I love them. I don't know, you guys, let me know which ones you think I should get. So let's just use the numbers or whatever. If I should choose the first player, second, third, fourth, or fifth. Okay, so this is the fifth one and the first one is obviously the first one. You, you get the deal. But let me now just do like a little overview once again so you can guys tell me. But again, this is not sponsored because I feel like I'm literally doing an ad because <laughs> I'm so excited about it and I'm gonna be showing you. But this is just such an exciting decision to me, you know? Like I want to make the right decision and I want to look good and... <sighs>
I'm saying hi to you again from coffee, from making my coffee, but I just came back from F45. I literally had a class at 8.20 today with my friends and it was upper body. I did upper body because today we did like a sort of a, like you could choose between upper body and lower body and I chose upper body because obviously I run a lot and I don't want to really, I don't really want to use my legs anymore. Um, but I just came back. We also did some smoothies and stuff with them. Uh, we hanged out for a little bit. Momento. And it was super fun. Honestly, I am feeling so positive right now and the sun is kind of shining. And now I'm gonna make myself coffee. I might eat something, so we might make some breakfast because I had a smoothie in their house. But the last time I drank it, I needed to eat something like an hour later. So I think I'm gonna just eat something more, just some more protein or something. Uh, so you're gonna think about it in a second. And today's plans, honestly, I need to do some work. Again, I need to edit next week's video for you guys. And I mean, start editing at least. And I'm sorry, but I'm just making coffee. I'm, I'm desperate, okay? I'm sorry for the noise. here okay so yeah so the plan is to edit the video and also I randomly this morning I randomly booked a pedicure for 6 p.m. so we're gonna go there as well and yeah and we're just gonna have a fun day we'll see where it goes honestly I've been feeling so positive recently and I don't want to change it honestly like I don't know I think I told you in my last vlog or maybe two vlogs ago no I think it was the last vlog that my mood has been like that like it's been good day bad day good day bad day but it's been kind of improving recently and I'm so happy about it, you guys. I missed feeling this way so much. And yeah, it just makes me so happy that I feel this way again. I don't know if it's, I don't know if it's the sun, even though there's not much, that much sun, like the, the weather hasn't really changed much recently, but something, something is working and I'm just loving it. And also yesterday I made this amazing reel with that, with the glasses that I showed you yesterday. And I'm so proud of myself with it. I feel like I have so much more creativity in me and taking sort of like a break from Instagram and focusing a bit more on YouTube made me much more creative with my, with my short form content and lets me kind of bring out that voice a bit more than my voice because I don't feel that pressure of like, oh, I need to post five times a week or something. I just post whenever, post whenever I have something to say, something to show. And it's been working so well for me, honestly, not to jinx. So I'm, I'm just so happy. <sighs> yeah, life feels good recently. to becoming a person who cleans up to themselves recently. And so, because the thing about me is that I leave stuff as I go. Like, let's say I drink my tea, I'm just gonna leave it on the table. Like the, the cup, I'm gonna leave it on the table. Um, I'm gonna drink some water, I'm just gonna leave it. I took off my socks, I'm just gonna leave them on the floor. I, I ate my meal, I'm like, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna wash the dishes later. I just ate, I need a moment to relax. And you know the saying, clean space, clear mind? I love it. And I really need to start implementing it into my life more. Because yeah, as I told you, I'm just the person who just leaves stuff. So recently I've been really putting effort into, like let's say I'm gonna grab a hoodie from my wardrobe and I'm gonna wear it for my walk with Snowy. I'll make sure that once I'm back from home, I'm not gonna just throw it somewhere. I'm gonna put it back into the wardrobe. Or I just cooked, I ate, I'm cleaning up straight away. I'm not leaving it till the evening. 
I'm gonna have to admit it's not always working out. I have moments, I have days where I'm just like, ah, whatever, like, I can't be bothered. But I really am putting effort into trying and, and doing that because it really makes a difference. And it's that type of a small change that really, like, makes you feel better. Oh, <laughs>